First, I would like to point out all of the pre-installed apps that are made by Samsung themselves. It makes sense for the OEM to install apps that they feel are useful or that can make them some money. But you'll be happy to learn that all of these can either be disabled through the traditional app info page or you can find the package name for said application and then manually uninstall them with a popular ADB command that I've shown here on this channel. These apps include Samsung Smart Switch, Smart Things, Samsung Wallet, Game Launcher, Samsung Health, Galaxy Store, Samsung Internet, Samsung Cloud, Galaxy Themes, Samsung Notes, Bixby, Samsung Pass, Samsung Members, Samsung Dex, Samsung Kids, Samsung Global Goals, Samsung Health Monitor, Galaxy Wearable, Game Booster Plus, and finally, Pinup. Removing these apps from your phone will not break your device in any way, but you should be aware that some features rely on these apps to be installed. For example, it's logical to assume that we cannot use anything that relies on Bixby if we disable that application on our Samsung Galaxy S25. You should also realize that removing Samsung Pass and Samsung Wallet will prevent you from using your phone to pay for things using those services. So it's a good idea to think things through and only remove applications that you will not rely on in any way.